Shotgun has no range. PS3 has no games. PS3 has no games. Ooh, reach to it. Are you seriously about to do that to me, boy? They, well, they can't jump. They're, They're following! They're following the grapple! <laughs> just imagine if you could just quicker than that. How is this working and why is it working? Oh my what god. What the fuck? Oh Got him all! <laughs> there you go, boy! There you go! There you go! No Life way. 1v5's gonna be an what issue. What the fuck? The ultimate, Are you serious? The ultimate repel bait. That's how I do this it, is... boy. <laughs> boy. Like fishing. Here I come, jerks! Welcome back to Rainbow Seven Cheese, the most operator first person shooter in the world that's now so non toxic it may as well be a box of fucking crayons. That oh, anal dude. has been banned due to toxic. We out here banning people like it ain't no thing. Yeah, anal, okay. Real Navy SEAL 420 has been banned due to toxic here. behavior. <laughs> dude, some of these are just great. You better have a good fucking time banned for toxicity. Ooh. They better have a good fucking time. Dead ass! Dead ass. <laughs> <laughs> this is how you avoid yeah, getting banned else. for toxicity right here. And now that I've had time to sink my teeth into Operation Chimichanga, there's a new kid on the block that's almost single-handedly changed the meta. And I ain't even lying. She asked me if I lied. Bitch, I've been lying. I mean, I'm not lying, but I'm talking about lying. You know what I mean. He's the scooter riding, backpack wearing, 1984 style spying big brother that will find you no matter where you try to hide. I feel so bad for whoever was up in the bathroom hiding. It was probably <laughs> it was probably Rook taking a fat ogre shit up there. Blazing through his background in the interest of brevity, his pullout game is weak, Twitch gave him his drone, Doc hates him, and Thatcher even slapped the taste out of his mouth one time for what I can only assume was excessive bragging about his unmanned drone. GPS satellites. Unmanned drones, fucking laser sights. Fucking laser, laser sights. <laughs> Unmanned blades. Unmanned blades. <laughs> 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 oh, All I know is that a six inch blade never loses reception. <laughs> fucking satellites. <laughs> Fucking satellite. With this unmanned drone, formerly known as the EE-1D, not to be confused with the Summit 1G, he's able to activate a scan that after a three second countdown exposes the real time position of any operator that moves by turning them red. Turning red by buying my brand new t-shirt via the link below, that's awesome. Turning red as a result of moving during a lion scan, that's not awesome because you're probably about to stop breathing four letters w a s d if you hit any of these while the scan is active you're exposed for the remainder of that scan you can crouch prone shoot deploy a gadget and even lean not that lean lean without being exposed but the instant you hit any of your movement keys you pop up with a real-time red outline for every single enemy attacker to see it's time for <laughs> securing the container one. if you don't stop him. shooting Wait, where <laughs> There, I found no, him! I found him! Me. There we go, there we go. I know, I was, sh I was shooting Blitz. <laughs> I oh, almost had the A's. No. I would not have, he probably would have killed me if I would not have had that activated. Thank Jeez. God. Just think of it like you're standing in front of a T-Rex. If you don't move, he can't see you. But if you shift your feet, you're dead meat. The only other counter, beyond standing still, is being in range of a mute jammer, and with him already being a hard counter to dipshit to Kebby, there's never been a better time to have him on your team to tell the attackers to mind their own damn business. I'm yeah, not I'm a scientist. Just don't move. No, 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 we're on this thing. I'm we can't so be detected. Yeah, we can't be detected, Mickey. I knew hey. it. I knew you put this down here for a reason. Hey, I'm accomplishing things. Yosef? Yeah, I think there's a Maybe buck above us, go. too. being generous this Christmas. <laughs> One final point to keep in mind is that Viggle is not immune to his scan. I know that doesn't make sense and everybody's butt hurt about it, but for all you Viggle mains out there, your diplomatic immunity from drones has just been revoked. Get your fat Two, backpack out one. of my way. Red light. Ooh, what's up there, Mitchell, you dumbass? Defying all logic and reason, he's a two-speed two-armor, even though he's heavier than to chunks and has a backpack capable of fitting all of his quarantine gear, four garbage teammates, depression, crippling alcoholism, six cases of Glanguli Blue, and a metric shit ton of his favorite snack. Oh, okay, cool. And coming from a family of devout Catholics, he still manages to find enough room for his most prized possession of all. The Bible. This is the Bible. You question the words of the mighty Jimmy! You
can make them yellow if you want to be a 200 pound minion, white if you want to be an abominable snowman, red if you want to cosplay the Spetsnaz from Modern Warfare 2, and blue if you're all about that G.I. Joe. Man, look at this dude trying to be Cobra Commander or shit. What the f- I really wish that it was realistic, so if you had like the outbreak uh, outfit, whenever you run, all you hear is just like- <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> you just sound like a trash bag running way too fast. You're all sweaty and shit. Oh, God. Much like his fellow French attacker Twitch, he's got one terrifying primary and two nonsense primaries because let's not lie here, the only time that I use the M417 is when I need to one-tap castle mains from across the map. Oh, my God, they're getting cocky as fuck. What are they doing? I didn't even know you could go that way. Neither did right. I. This is, is new. Is <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> Why is that so hilarious? What the fuck? <laughs> it's like he tripped and fell on. <laughs> Somebody <laughs> tripped and fell on his shoelaces. Oh and my get god. One thing. The only Why reason you should ever use one the back. M417 right here. I've got nothing against you castle mains out there because you're certainly a uniquely motivated bunch. Hey, no, I was doing on my 17th too. birthday, I was running my own Fortune 500 company and whooping my own ass. Wow, damn. I'm about to be whooping your ass here in a minute if you say some shit like that again. But the practical application of the M417 is pretty limited. Same goes for your shoddy because I love pumping and dumping as much as any of you. Nope, I'm sorry. That's gonna be a no for me, dog. I'm sorry, small man. Bang, 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 bang. But neither of those options compare to his 308 battle rifle with a 50 round drum mag. I mean, just feast your eyes on this thing. It looks like it's responsible for more deaths than smallpox. Killionaire. I will say that the recoil isn't exactly a breeze. I think way too many people describe it as a laser beam when it's not. It bounces around significantly, even in short bursts, but because it hits like a hammer and you've got a mag magazine that big, it's the perfect weapon to spam at anything that pops up red. Okay, it's going down. It's going For down. Oh. I'm yelling, Cavs oh shit. In the room with you. Cavs in the room with you, be careful. Oh, she was right there. I'm hitting it again. Over by me, over by me, footsteps. Where are you, woman? Yes, I got her all the way through there. How many soft surfaces, my man? Oh. <laughs> That's you know, ridiculous. I may as well just be a, a licensed contractor now that just specializes in destruction. Oh. Specialize in retail. Details. <laughs> <laughs> the icing on the cake is access to the legendary nerf or nothing magnum, which is not only superior to Ella's scorpion now that it has moderate recoil. She's in there with you. Got her! Nice. Oh, yeah! There's the magnum! There's the magnum! Right, um, pink. <laughs> <laughs> Being so poisoned and stunned and Jaeger just got orange headgear? What is my life? What is my life? Moderate recoil. <laughs> <laughs> but it's even capable of taking down a Sam Squamsh, which is reason enough to always keep this motherfucking thing on you. Yes, we got a Sam Squanch in the game. Please tell me somebody gets that reference. <laughs> Nobody watches reference. Trailer Park Boys in the Sam Squamsh? Oh, God. Are you selling your body for cheeseburgers, Randy? A man's gotta eat, don't he? I can just grab the hostage. You want? Do it. I'll cover. Okay. No, no you I won't. won't cover. No, you won't. He's. I, I got my revolver, boy. <laughs> Don't even worry. Come here. No, you won't. Oh, yes, got oh, him before he went off. That was so oh, close. Get that out of here. Oh god, the Sam Squamsh. The oh, Sam Squamsh god. almost got me. Thank God, my revolver. Jesus Christ. Is ten out god. of ten. One hundred percent. You cannot shoot a revolver that fast oh, ever. Oh lord. Your fucking it's wrist would snap. Noon. If you unironically use the shit tier 9 mil over the god tier 357 magnum, please never touch a French operator ever again, because you're an embarrassment to the gigan. I'm wiggling in. I was just- I didn't know if you killed him or not. Yeah, I downed him and I was gonna throw a grenade on him. 
Boom! Right in the mouth! Oh, oh baby oh, yeah. castle! Now that you know what Lion's working with, allow me to share the one word that makes him so menacing and probably overpowered. Pickles! For example, me droning out this Jaeger here has put him into a major pickle because I'm immediately hitting my scan and he's forced to either A, stand still and get pre-fired, or B, move his feet and get wall banged from popping up red. Yeah, you see that? That's the definition of being stuck between a rock and a hard place. Full disclosure, it's not foolproof or 100% guaranteed to work, so before you start mashing your keyboard saying, It doesn't always work, Badger. You only play casual. My name is Jeff. Well, thanks for the input, Jeff. Thanks for the input, Jeff. Thanks for the input, Jeff. Thanks for the right, input. Jeff. <laughs> Jeff. Jeff. You, you earned this. <laughs> <laughs> but even without it being a 100% guarantee, it heavily tilts the scales in your favor when it comes to terminating pesky roamers or enemies caught in vulnerable positions and is awfully reminiscent of another operator. Ying. I know it may sound strange, but Ying and Lion are one and the same in so many different ways. Ying playing by herself? Absolutely, positively useless. Ying with a coordinated team that is communicating with each other? Absolutely, positively a nightmare. And we're not just talking standard issue nightmare. We're talking nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. Same goes for Lion. All by himself, you see scans that don't yield any advantage to the attacking team, but when he's organized with buddies, that's a totally different story. <laughs> This game is fucking racist. <laughs> Pretty sure they know that I'm here. Oh, that's false. My EED is on cooldown. Excuse me, what? These headshots make no sense. Oh, I got him. I got him. Has no am no help. I only have four Dude, that shots. Was so dumb. There you go. Come on, come on, Ella. Oh, oh, still got oh, him. Headshot. Damn. That was ridiculous. Is that an ace? Is that an and ace? I was like, and I was like. Nah. No, I, I miss one. one. I miss one because Fink is using steroids, but that's technically cheating. All right. Oh we're, wait, we're, right. We'll I consider forgot. it a, an an ace by disqualification. Let's call it that. So I actually broke my headphones when I threw them down. <laughs> really? <laughs> <laughs> it's all fucking fun and games. So you break some shit. Especially when it comes to the bomb game mode, because with enemies scrambling to destroy a diffuser while you're spamming your scans, getting that lunchbox deployed is basically a death sentence for every remaining adversary. Nice shooting. It's wiener time. It's wiener. <laughs> I have one oh, more, no. by the way. Oh my god, I can't see. They blew me up. Boom. <laughs> no! They might be on the bomb. No, they're oh, not yet. There you go. Shoot him! I got him. Oh, baby, that was close. That was kind of close. That's so handy to have the retake, but oh boy, that was close. That shit is so good. No matter how much shit is going south, like your teammates are killing each other, Cav just interrogated, you're down 2v4, none of that matters if the lunchbox is activated and your lion is alive. No sweat. Pasta, you dumb just, bitch. Just, just I tried running behind playing. you and you backed up. I don't have any fucking... Just plant it. Plant it. Cav. You got it. You got it. You Cavs got it. Got me. Cover me. Cover me. Cover me. You got it, boy. <laughs> Here, we'll counter. We'll counter. We'll counter with this. Ooh, no, no thanks. No thanks. Okay, there's Capcan. It don't matter. It don't matter. Yeah, running out. Oh, shit. I'll get him when he comes Do back in. Shoot? Nice. <laughs> I'm hitting it again. I'm hitting it again. Is he jump jumping out? Maybe? Oh, there she is. Oh, you got her. I was gonna say. Seven and oh. Tobin being a savage. Savage. Yeah, with the iron sights, he cannot be stopped. Is that a four K and a team kill? Oh my god. Eat shit. <laughs> That's all you gotta do, man. Just throw it on your lunchbox and look at the flick of your wrist. Even when you forget your wrist monitor at home and you're looking at absolutely nothing. Oh shit, it still works. As a result of this immensely powerful ability, it's safe to say that Lion is king right now. And I'm not sure if Gubisoft intentionally made a movie reference with Finka's facial features, but... Am I the first one to think of the joke how Lion is Lion and Finka has a scar? Like Lion King? Is, have you heard that before? I hate you. Anybody? Anybody I hate at all? You. Stop talking. <laughs> Please.
Banned. Yeah, don't, fucking don't banned. I don't, don't want to think about that. Get him, out of, Get here. him out of here. And he's out of no, here. No. No. Oh, whoa, shit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's, let's take it down a notch. Can you, like, dial it back, please? That was a little too aggressive. You are I'm so on, lucky. I'm on, the edge. I'm on the edge, like when Scar dangled. Oh, Move fucking us. no! No more! No more Lion King jokes! Just don't forget to run claymores over flashbangs because using a passive weapon as an active weapon is a bona fide good time. I wonder what that is for. It's claymore time, you ready? Oh, oh, she's out of here, buddy. Who's dead? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! No, the triple no, claymore! The triple claymore! The triple claymore. Oh, man. <laughs> You downed him. Perfect, perfect. Keep peeking, yes. Why am I stuck? What happened? Oh. We get ripped. Yeah, we did. Okay. I'm gonna go to this door. Oh, here they are. Got one. I think. Ah. No, I oh, didn't. No, I didn't. Doing? Yes, we still got him. Okay, perfect. Wait, wait, wait. Don't kill him Back. yet. Boom, baby. <laughs> oh, oh my god. <laughs> Wall on flash. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> That's just disrespectful. Disrespectful. My ankles land. Okay, all right. Uh, BBB. BB. BB. Right. Uh, I mean, whatever the one you're not on. Or not. Damn it. Well, we we're all three down. People down. Maybe Unless he, he gets my claymore, he's going to make he it. He doesn't think we're all dead. It's okay. He got it. What <laughs> are the odds of that? <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, man. I was like, maybe I should put a claymore. Oh. That oh, was a good it. idea. <laughs> and that's about it. I would like to thank you very much for watching. But before I go, I got to tell you about this thing. Those of you from my Twitch chat already know all about the crying seal and the smug seal, but the real inspiration behind this one was this. Over the past three months here in LA, I've met more of you than I ever have before, and almost every single one of you, including Eric, who's probably not even watching now because he's a complete shitter, tells me the same thing. Every time you meet YouTubers, especially in LA, it's that common, they're totally different from what they are online. Like online, they're all PG and family friendly and they don't swear, yet you see them in real life getting blasted off a of Jameson at an Olive Garden on a Tuesday. But every time I meet one of you guys, it's yeah, Badger, online you're kind of a dumbass, smug piece of shit, but that's exactly who you are right now as you're standing before me. So in a certain way, the mask that I wear on the internet is the exact same thing that's underneath, so I figured why not put that directly on my chest. So so if you'd like to pick up one for yourself, I will leave a link to Teespring down below. The cheaper ones are a little bit thicker like this one, and the premium ones are a little bit silkier. I wear both of them, it kind of depends on the day. And hopefully that whole backstory made sense. Maybe it was complete incoherent nonsense, but whatever. I should end the video now because I'm running out of breath and I shouldn't have ordered that burger at Starbucks. <laughs>